Welcome back again for this week's edition of the Bulldog Broadcast, bringing you the news and updates from BHS. As you have seen throughout the week with the outfits and dress-up days, it's the annual homecoming week at BHS. The homecoming ceremony will be at halftime at the game tonight against Osawatomie. Due to restrictions at Liston Stadium, the game will be played at Eudora High School, with four fans per player being allowed to attend. The candidates for Queen are Cambria Crow, Emma Grossmey, and Olivia Kerr. The candidates for King are Hudson Allen, Jacob Hoffman, and Drew Schoendahler. Students will cast their votes today to elect this year's winning royalty. If any students are interested in participating in a winter sport that did not do a fall sport, we'll need to get a physical on file in the office before the first day of practice. Winter sports begin on Monday, November 16th. Speaking of sports, we will next go to sports reporter Ian McCoy for an update on the Bulldogs, followed by a homecoming special. The cross country team has regionals coming up this Saturday. Cross country regionals are being hosted by the Bulldogs this year. The following week, they will be going to state cross country meet. The girls are ranked number one and the boys are ranked number seven. The football team won their first football game this last Friday. The ending score was 23-20 over Santa Fe Trail. The football boys have a home game this Friday against Osawatomie. Their record is currently one, four, one and four. Friday's game is also homecoming. The Bulldog soccer team's record is 9-5-1. They had two games this week. They won their first game with a score of 5-1 over Midland Academy, and the second game they lost in overtime with a score of 2-1 to Spring Hill. The volleyball team had one game this week against West Franklin, then one after going to four sets. Volleyball has sub-state on October 24th at Eudora. They have to win on Saturday to advance to the 4A state tournament. That's all I have for you today for the BHS Sports Report. Good luck, Bulldog Nation, and back to you, Drew, in the studio. Today I'm here with homecoming candidate Drew Schoendahler. What all have you been involved in at BHS? I've done cross country, soccer, link, basketball, and track. What have been your favorite classes and why? My favorite classes are probably like PE and weights, keep me active, and uh, yeah. What are your future plans? My future plans after high school is to go to college somewhere uh, to do something with sports medicine and athletic training. All right, now to the important stuff. Favorite movie ever? Definitely 42, Jackie Robinson. One of, it's a pretty inspirational movie. You hop in your car and crank that music. What can we expect to hear? Uh, definitely some Juice World all the time, some J. Cole, maybe some 21 Savage. Okay, you're headed out to grab a bite to eat. Where are you going? I'm either headed to Chick-fil-A or some McDonald's to get some chicken nuggets or spicy chicken sandwich. Go to. What is your favorite Baldwin tradition? Uh, anything to do with XC. I love hanging out with them. and yeah. Nice. Last and final question. Ema or Rock Chalk? Uh, definitely go Badgers. Today I'm here with homecoming candidate Jacob Hoffman. What all have you been involved in at BHS? Uh, well, I've been in the musical for four years. Uh, I've, I'm a, a captain in Scholars Bowl. Um, I'm going to hopefully get chess club started back up again this year. Right. Yeah, and uh, I'm in band and choir. Awesome. What have been your favorite classes and why? Well, I think band and choir have always been pretty fun. The same uh, teacher for or four years, and this year with Miss Naughton taking over for Miss Buffum, who's doing a wonderful job, by the way. And uh, yeah, it's just fun to see uh, our progression as the years go by. What are your future plans? Right now, I hope to go to uh, the University of Michigan to uh, study, to do a double major in political science and secondary education. All right, now to the important stuff. Favorite movie ever? This one changes a lot, but uh, I think I think right now I'm saying uh, Star Wars: Revenge of the Sith, just because you know you know Anakin, you know you know Obi Wan, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you hop in your car and crank that music. What can we expect? Bob Dylan or classical. <laughs> <laughs> Now you're headed out to grab a bite to eat. Where are you going? I mean, really the only place in Baltimore is Burger King. So that's, that's about it. Out of anywhere you choose oh, Burger King? Yeah, Burger King. <laughs> okay. What is your favorite Baldwin tradition? Um, I've, I've probably got to go back to uh, band here and just say uh, our, our boosting uh, at every 
like at a lot of major varsity mm-hmm. games. That's that's always fun to to just play just to play that. Awesome. Last and final question, Ema or Rock Chalk? Well, I'm kind of wearing a, a a shirt here, which kind of can give you a a little uh, hint. Hint, yeah. Thank you for for the answer to that question. Rock Chalk. Here today, I have homecoming candidate Hudson Allen. What all have you been involved in at BHS? Uh, I've been involved in cross country, trap shooting, uh, the musical, and I think that's it. Yeah. What have been your favorite classes and why? Uh, Seventh Hour Spanish 4. I love Spanish because I think it's just a great opportunity to learn and culture and things like that. What are your future plans? Um, I'm attending Wichita State University for a criminal justice program. Nice. All right, now to the important stuff. Favorite movie ever? Napoleon Dynamite. (laughs) You hop in your car and crank that music. What can we expect to hear? Uh, Punk. Okay, you're headed out to grab a bite to eat. Where are you going? Ramen bowl. What is your favorite Baldwin tradition? Uh, I like going to the basketball games. Last and final question, Ema or Rock Chalk? Rock Chalk, I guess. Today I'm here with homecoming candidate Emma Grossme. What all have you been involved in at BHS? Um, I play volleyball. I've been on the volleyball team for four years. I've played softball. This will be my fourth year. Uh, I did girls wrestling last year. This will be my second year. I'm involved in Letterman's Club, Stuco, Link, Speak, Mardi Gras Diversity Day. And, yeah, that's about it. What have been your favorite classes and why? Um, this year I'd say ceramics because Miss Weaver is the coolest person ever. What are your future plans? Um, next year I'm planning on attending Baker University to play volleyball and to wrestle. All right, now to the important stuff. Favorite movie ever? Jurassic Park. You hop in your car and crank that music. What can we expect to hear? Morgan Wallen, all day long. Okay, you're headed out to grab a bite to eat. Where are you going? Chick-fil-A, every day of the week. Seriously. Uh, What is your favorite Baldwin tradition? Um, I love Maple Leaf, and I love football games, like since I was little. Friday Night Lights are my favorite thing for sure. Last and final question, Ema or Rock Chalk? Rock Chalk, baby. Here today, I have homecoming candidate Olivia Kerr. What all have you been involved in at BHS? Um, student council my sophomore, junior, and senior year. Uh, Mardi Gras, Stand Up to Cancer, and National Honor Society. I'm also involved in track and swimming. What have been your favorite classes and why? I like oral communications. Um, I think it's a really fun class. Got get to talk in front of the class a lot and um, weights. What are your future plans? To major in elementary education and hopefully swim at the college level. All right, now to the important stuff. Favorite movie ever? Definitely Mamma Mia. You hop in your car and crank that music. What can we expect to hear? Probably pop or country. Okay, you're headed out to grab a bite to eat. Where do you go? Raising Cane's. What is your favorite Baldwin t- tradition? I love the class cut points because it gets everyone involved. Last and final question, Ema or Rock Chalk? Ema. Today I'm here with homecoming candidate Cambria Crow. What all have you been involved in at BHS? I have been involved in soccer, track, basketball, and then this year's um, Stuco. What have been your favorite classes and why? Um, This year, my favorite class is definitely anatomy, and it's definitely because of Dr. Yu. What are your future plans? So far, I am not for sure what my future plans are, but hopefully I'll be attending a college soon. All right, now the important stuff. Favorite movie ever? Definitely Parent Trap. I love that movie. You hop in your car and crank that music. What can we expect? Definitely some rap music. (laughs) Okay, you are headed out to grab a bite to eat. Where do you go? I would go to Texas Roadhouse and eat those rolls. Those are the best. Oh, yeah. What is your favorite Baldwin tradition? Um, Probably Maple Leaf or else just Friday night football games. Last and final question. Ema or Rock Chalk? (laughs) Ema. Who's the better cook? Who's most likely to live with their parents until they're in their 30s? (laughs) 
Who cares more about their grades? <laughs> Who is more adventurous? Who's the messier one? Who is most likely to rule the world? <laughs> Who is most likely to sleep anywhere? <laughs> Who is most likely to learn a foreign language? Lastly, who is most likely to live in a big city? Who's most likely to live with their parents until they're in their 30s? <laughs> Who's most likely to win the lottery? <laughs> Who's most likely to be a couch potato? <laughs> Who's most likely to be late to an event? <laughs> Who is the messier one? Who is most likely to get lost? Who is most likely to live in a big city? And who's the better cook? Who cares the most about their grades? Who is more likely to learn a foreign language? Who is most likely to be a stand-up comedian? Who is most likely to listen to classical music? Who is most likely to start their own business? Who is most likely to live with their parents until they're in their 30s? Who is most likely to get lost? And lastly, who is the messier one? Thanks for watching today's Bulldog broadcast. Have an awesome weekend, and don't forget to always walk on the right side of the hallway and stay classy.